<laughs> We're back, kids. Yeah. I'm not going to disable comments. Don't worry. All right, I got a package and a story. And I'll do the whole package story here. Stanley. I guess Stanley? That's weird. It's supposed to be from DeWalt. Does Stanley own DeWalt? Does DeWalt own Stanley? I don't know. We'll see what's in here. I'm not even really sure. This is going to be a surprise for me, too, I guess. Oh, yeah, I got a bunch of paper. I might have my address. Let's get that out of there. All right, that's what we got. That's what we got. Let's take a look here. What is this thing? The DeWalt. This is crucial, kids. Lifetime warranty. And if you know anything about me, if you sell me a product with a lifetime warranty, you best be prepared to warranty it for the life of the time. All right. 150 foot chalk reel. It's a two to one gear system. And I'm going to explain why this is different and why we're doing a deal here. This is a warrantied item. I had to warranty a chalk reel. And which chalk reel did I warranty? <clears throat> this chalk reel. And I'm going to show you what happened. And I'm going to say, it's just, and it's crazy. Let me get this camera in here. Can I get a zoom? All right, we're gonna get a zoom in on this. When I call them, and here's the here's the sad part. This has been warrantied. <laughs> this is a warranty thing, and I will go back out. I warranted this when I broke it, and I haven't, and I never, I never got around to really using this thing until I started this house I'm building, or sorry, the house I'm helping with. And uh, we, we laid out the foundation on the footings, which is the perimeter of the house. And we laid out the foundation on the garage, which is the perimeter of the garage. And then the concrete uh, dudes came out to do, the, to do the floor in the basement. And their chalk line broke. And I was like, dude, I've got a chalk line. Just You can borrow mine. And they broke it. And I'm not saying they broke it. It broke it. So, like, okay. One, two, three, four, like... We'll just say two dozen times this was used. And I think that's overestimating by nearly a dozen times. And I'm going to show you what, break, what broke. And it's the exact same thing. See, these gears are all good. This is how little it's been used. There's not even chalk inside here. It's this. This Helica gear. If you look right there, you can see the gear broke. This is the only piece I need. When I called DeWalt, it's like, dude, send me one of these. Actually, send me a bag of these. Nope. They sent me a whole chalk reel. The first time it broke, they sent me a whole new chalk reel. I'm like, whatever, dude. I don't need a whole chalk reel. It's a pain in my ass because like, I already got a pound of chalk in there. But they sent me a whole chalk reel. And I'm going to show you. I'm going to show you. I didn't even install the new string. Here. July 2018, DeWalt. That's the string that came with that one. I didn't even install I just took the string out of the broken one because it hadn't even, the other one hadn't even been barely used either. It's just, it's just like, so I've got this, ch <laughs> ah, whatever. I, I can't even describe it to you. I mean, it's just like, and I, and I went on the, I went on the, uh, the old interwebs, and I decided to like, well, if you else have any problems with the stuff, yes, people are like, dude, I used the chalk line three times and it break. So what I learned is if you uh, take a half inch drive, you can. Uh, backwards it's righty tidy or left sorry it's lefty loosey sorry i don't know if you can see that we're reeling in and you can get the chalk line back in here and i actually got it back here because i had to i had to chalk like i had to chalk another set of lines like i needed this thing the other day i was like dude i gotta chalk these lines so i just what i did is i hand i hand wheeled this thing in Took it out to the job site. It's like, well, we get one shot at it because I'm not going to tear it apart again on the job site. And it was like, I literally called him from the job site. I was like, dude, this thing broke on me. And like, 
the call, I'm, I, mean, I don't know for sure, but I'm pretty sure I called their 1-800 number and they connected me to a dude that was living in a different continent that rhymes with India. And he speaks English, that's fine. But the connection was such crap, it was double echo. Everything was an echo, 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 echo. It's like, dude, like I speak American uh, dialect English and he spoke Indian dialect English, which is all English and I can't understand that. But when it echoes... Dude, we both, he couldn't hear me either. We kept saying, what, 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 what? Like, oh my God, it was terrible. So there you go. While I'm back in, I thought about trying to like rig something up, just have like a, a temporary, but the problem is like this kind of, I mean, look at that. There ain't even chalk spilled out of there yet. Like, it kind of moves around. I mean, I thought about just Jerry rigging something up there and just making it work. What I'm going to do is I'm going to ship this off to my brother who's got a 3D printer and see if he can print me some. I thought about trying to find this Helica gear in steel and get a piece of square stock and just welding one of these up. It's like, dude, what can that cost? It, it's, it's literally nothing. And so far, I, this is my third one. I mean, come, come on. That's crazy. So... One of the things I think what they've done, because obviously this is discontinued because they probably warranted 100 million of these things. If you look, it's a three to one gear ratio. Well, they changed that. This one is a two to one gear ratio. So less torquing coming in. Now, I do like the fact that they, 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 they allegedly put a, a lock spot on the edge here. And supposedly they put feet on it so it sits on its edge. So this is an upgraded item, whatever. I didn't add, I'm like, trust me, DeWalt, thank you. Thanks for sending me a brand new unit. Also, thanks, thanks for sending me this brand new unit, but all I ever needed was the gear. Like, why you didn't just have a box of gears and just post them out? I mean, maybe people don't, I don't know, whatever. But I don't play games, dude. You, if, if it says that, that is not on me. You need, uh, okay. So they, they're, they're, they're holding their, let's open this thing up. Let's take a look inside this thing. Sorry for my rant. It's just like, it just blows my mind. And my favorite part was uh, the dude that was using my tool that broke it didn't even be like, oh, dude, sorry, I broke your tool. Can I fix it? What he did is he wound it around there and never said anything to me. So when I went, after they left, I walked out and found my, well, actually one of his employees mumbled something about broken chalk line or not. whatever. I just, I mean, what I would told the guy is don't worry about it. It's got a warranty. That's what I would have told him. Now, what I'm curious about, see, this is this this has got me bothered. How do I how do I four screws? One, two, three, four. I can get in there. What are you doing, DeWalt? This is unfixable, un unserviceable. I mean, I, I think I'm gonna put this chalk line. I'm just gonna move all this chalk line into this one because it takes a lot of chalk to fill these lines. Does that look worn out? I don't think that looks worn out. Let's be going into the third. I mean, it's a little fuzzy on the end. I think I'm just going to do it. Oh, just did that. Totally spaced it. So, yeah, I just, I don't know. I mean, this is the kind of chalk line that you use all the time. But when you need something, you need it. Like, it's really good for concrete work. But, like, I would... I was reading reviews of people being like, yeah, I bought three of them and two of them died in the first like four chalks. I was just like, how, I don't know how they get away with it. Like how it's financially like feasible to like, I mean, I, I suppose maybe they're just calling it a disposable item. You know, if you sell a hundred thousand of them, only 25% of the people are going to call and want a replacement. And then it's like, it's like they're selling things that's designed to fail, like literally designed to fail. Like that gear is literally designed to fail. There's no getting around that. Like that, I mean, because exactly how the other one broke, just one little tooth kind of broke off and then it's done. I mean, that's got to be generously, this is plastic, generously speaking, 25 cents. You can put that in a postage envelope and just send them out. Like, what, what are you thinking? Like, that's crazy. Oh, that's too complicated for a person to service. It's like, dude, it's four screws. You just drop a new one in. Like, send me a bag of them. Like, I could service that in the field if I wanted to. I don't know, whatever. So this is my new one. I'm not going to bore you with me tearing it apart because 
I'm just not. So ho hopefully I can get away uh, without having to like replace this one. Although I don't, I don't, I don't use this stuff very often, so it's like I don't know how you're supposed to snap that on. Whatever. <sighs> yep, there it is. Dewalt and uh, Dewalt broken, broken garbage shit flying. Good luck with you. Good luck. Stay safe.